Hi, I'm Matthew Coase from CommitmentConnection.com and today I have a question from a woman in our community who says, men need to understand that because some of us women are strong and independent doesn't mean that that should scare you. It doesn't mean that we think we're better than you are. It's who we are and what we have had to do for ourselves. Please help. So, you know, I, I get this complaint a lot that women feel like they're intimidating men. And um, let, let me just share a story with you real quick. Uh, w when I first got into the dating industry, I um, came in as a client. And one of the things that I learned um, kind of right off the bat, uh, it was, I think it was probably in my first serious relationship that I got into was uh, my, my girlfriend used to um, come up to me and she would like do this thing where she would like rub her hand like on my skin like really gently and lightly and and uh, she would rub it all over my back you know rub her fingers on my back and stuff and and I always remember thinking like what are you doing like why are you doing that and um, one of the things that I ended up figuring out from uh, just doing a lot of studying and research on, on the whole topic is that uh, we typically try to attract people to us using the methods that we like to be attracted to. So um, in that case, she um, it turned her on from when... Uh, I would gently rub her skin like that. And um, she thought that maybe it would do the same thing to me. And uh, <laughs> it just, it, it didn't. It wasn't a turn on at all. And um, how that relates to being a strong, independent women, woman is that a lot of times um, strong, independent women seem to think that uh, the, these traits that they have as a strong, independent woman, sh as a strong, independent woman, should be attractive to men. Um, it's rarely the case that a guy is scared off or intimidated by you because you're a strong, in independent woman. It's more likely the case that he's just not attracted to you for it. You know, whereas you might be attracted to a guy who is a strong, independent guy who um, wants to, uh, who, who has his life together and, and you know, is, is very masculine and has all that kind of stuff going on. Men might be, might respect the fact that you're a strong, independent woman, but he's not going to be attracted to you for it men are attracted to women for other reasons. Um, th there are a few guys that are kind of intimidated and scared off by women who are strong and independent, but those are guys that you don't want anyway. Um, you know, uh, the whole point here is that uh, if you want to be attractive to a guy, um, you need to, it, you can be a strong, independent woman, but you need to pull out the feminine part of yourself the the um you need to connect with a man on a deep emotional level that's what will attract him to you being a strong independent woman has no bearing on that whatsoever unless you try to use that to attract a guy or think that a guy should be attracted to you for that which he uh he probably won't ever be unless he's a weak feminine guy um, so that's it. If you, if you are a strong, independent woman, you know, don't worry about it. You know, there's lots of guys, most men that I talk to out there want a woman who's strong and independent, but they also want a woman who is connected to their feminine, to her feminine side and can connect with him in that way. Cause that's what attracts a man to a woman, not being strong and independent that doesn't matter either way, um, although a lot of times it's looked at as a cool plus to who you are and, and um, that, that you do have some things together, which is awesome. So uh, if you want more advice on how to 
attract a man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And uh, I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.